What, what is it like for you coping with those moments where, for example, you can't keep up with your friends walking along somewhere? Or I just joke and say that I'm lazy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, I like that. I really like that, actually. My name is Shani, and um, I'm 25 years old. I go to Kingston University and study aerospace engineering, and I've been diagnosed with pulmonary hypertension, and Isomanga syndrome since I was nine months old. I think it affected me real bad when I was 19. When I was on a holiday in Sri Lanka and we went high up in the mountains, it was above altitude and I didn't know, and my parents didn't know that I was not supposed to go so high up in the altitude. Um, and it affected my lungs and um, it caused pneumonia and I started coughing up blood and from then I deteriorated. You just got to stay positive, you just got to turn every negative into a positive and just tell yourself that, you know, this is just a phase, this is just a phase. That's how I get through each time I end up in hospital, I just tell myself it's a phase, you know, because you don't want your illness to consume you, because that's not who you are. You are your own person. I do aerospace engineering, so it's quite an intense course and it requires every day coming to uni for lectures five days a week and extra hours on top of revision and studying and assignments. So it's been quite an intense uh, few months for me and I'm quite surprised that I haven't fallen ill, especially during the winter time. But when you've got something to focus on, you don't really you don't let your illness take over you and make who you are so because you're so focused on something else. A lot of my friends do tend to forget that I am, I have this illness until I end up in hospital or until they see me struggling when I go up too many stairs or keep up with them when they're walking far distance. But other than that, they don't treat me any different. Don't don't think you're a burden. Don't be with someone, even in a relationship or with your friends. Don't feel like you're you're a burden to them. You will see a massive difference when you're with positive people, especially with your when you're with your friends who laugh and joke with you, and don't treat you any different because you're ill. You know, and they tend to forget you're ill. If they forget that you're ill, don't take an offence to it. To me, it's a compliment. <laughs> <laughs> or my friends forget or when someone forgets that I'm ill or say oh my god you don't look ill is a massive compliment to me and I don't see it as a negative thing like how how can you be so ignorant they're not being ignorant it's just because they see such a positive side to you and you need positive people like that who bring you up